Once the kid's put in the car and they just have the biggest grin on their face and the, the grin just like stays there forever and they get to go and it's on their own power, on their own terms, it's amazing. Amazing indeed. Some BSU students are making a big difference for little kids with special needs. These future engineers are helping these kids get mobile in adapted electric cars. Maggie O'Mara tells us all about Go Baby Go in tonight's Seven's Hero. Are you ready, dude? You want to get in your car? Let's go. Joaquin just turned three. Um, he has um, developmental delays. This proud three-year-old is now behind the wheel of a brand new car. He's moving and exploring. His physical therapist sent me an email one morning and said, um, hey, you should really sign Joaquin up for this. It's called Go Baby Go. <laughs> and um, I think it'd be great for him. So Go Baby Go is a foundation that helps um, disabled kids get around and start moving around at a really young age where otherwise they would be in a wheelchair or being held. It's kind of sitting on the ledge there. This is where the Society of Women Engineers at Boise State comes into the picture. We took on a few families and we started doing these cars. St. Luke's help us out a lot and they match us to families. We have paired with Boise State University Society of Women Engineers and the students in that program to volunteer their time and their talents. And we've also got volunteered with New Motion, which is a durable medical equipment company, as well as um, Home Depot has also um, provided some discounts and um, donated materials for us. Each car is adapted to a specific child with special needs in our community. Kids like Joaquin. We changed the uh, foot pedal to a large button in the front of the steering wheel, so it's very easy for them to push it and then they can just go on their own and it's very powerful for them and they get this huge grin on their face. We give them more back support than normally a Power Wheels has and uh, we give it more structure on the sides. For the past two years, they've had a build day at St. Luke's in Meridian. The result, 40 custom cars. We do, we purchase the cars for the families and then the only um, requirement we have of the families is that they come of the day of the build and they work with the students to make the car for their child. That's definitely an important piece is that they have that ownership piece of building this for their child. And I'm like, oh, you actually get a car. Joaquin's mom was thrilled with the whole experience. They're gonna build this car specifically for him um, and tailor it to his challenges and what he needs. So, and then you get to take it home. And I was just floored. I had no idea that something like that even existed. It kind of like just really opened something up for him and uh, that he didn't have access to before. These Boise State volunteers say there is nothing more rewarding than using their skills for good. 99% of us are women. So it's really great hands-on work and we, we have like this pride and joy that we make and then we can go out and we know it's gonna help a family for years. To know that there's this group who said, hey, we, there's a need for this and we need to do this for kids so that they can be included. It it's, means the world to us um, to see our kid be able to, to do these things other kids can do. The BSU Society of Women Engineers and Go Baby Go Kids Like Joaquin. Seven zeros.